So now let's talk about reflection using the elementary script. So I have my elementary plugin. Let me just import an object right here. So I'm going to go into the starter pack and I'm going to bring in this clock. So I'm just going to go over here, bring this clock right there. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a reflection layer for this. So I'm going to go over here and select this layer right here. I'm going to go into windows, I'm going to go into my elementary right here. And here you have an option to create a reflection. So once you create the reflection, it is telling me to select several 3D layers right here. So this is the three layer and a layer that is that will be copied in. So I need to create a new layer right here. So I need to create a new layer where my reflection will be. So I'm going to create a solid layer it's like this. So this is going to be my orange solid. And here I'm going to turn this into three layers. So I'm go going to select both of these and click on reflection. And once you do that, the reflection is actually created. So it is processing uh, and the reflection is actually created now. And now let me just go over here. Let me just rotate around the camera, the unified camera tool, just like that. And here you'll be able to see the reflection. All right. So in order to see the reflection, I'm going to take the solid layer over here and I'm going to bring it backwards. So let me just bring it backwards and you can see that there's the reflection of that 3D object on the object I selected. So now I can even like rotate this around so I can rotate this around just like this and you can see that the reflection is there. So it's just a copy of the object. It's just uh, the copy of the object right there. So if I were to rotate, rotate around right here, rotate around, rotate this, rotate this around like right here and you can see that the reflection is there. So sometimes when you when you want to add in reflection to some of your composition, then you can actually do this. So you want to add in the reflection to videos or something, you can usually use a plain object and use it as a reflection. So that is how you can use elementary reflection using the elementary script for element 3D plugin in After Effects. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.